His brother is a famous Olympic athlete and one of the famous Lost Boys survivors from South Sudan. NEU athlete Peter Lamong has plans of his own. Jennifer Miraval brings us his compelling story. Friends are all dead right now, of course. Everyone I grew up with, dead. Words from NAU runner Peter Lamong about his life. A life that many may not know began in the troubled region in South Sudan. Something he thinks about every day. Right. So basically, look, look at me. I'm here and then um, and I'm not doing anything. I feel like I'm being babysat throughout the schooling. And then... Um, <sighs> Lamong's older brother, Lopez, was not only an Olympian, but one of 20,000 lost boys who fled South Sudan back in 1987. These boys crossed more than 1,000 miles to reach the Kakuma refugee camp in Kenya. Peter moved to the U.S. back in 2009 at 12 years old with another brother. They were both placed in Fork Union Military Academy in Virginia. It was there where Peter improved his English, adjusted to the culture, and today, studying political science at NAU, Lamong is on a mission to hold a leadership position in the UN to help his people. I went on to politics and to, in a way, to understand of how the world works and also to see what is the government of South Sudan doing wrong. Lamong is determined to make a difference. I want to change something. I want to, I feel like um, I'm going to change the world. For those that know Lamong, he's confident, honest, and he knows it. He says that his courage lifts the people around him, especially his teammates on the NAU track and cross country team. I see it and I see them just like overcoming these and they, they, they go for another round and they go at it and it somehow it gives me something too. I will walk five Peter's love for running runs in the family and says that because of that, Lopez laid out a path for his family's future. It gave us some kind of hope saying, oh, uh, he's, he's kind of a big deal. Um, things might ha really happen for our future. And things have happened. Unfortunately, Lamong also lost his father and two of his four brothers to disease back in 2016. This only pushed him to move forward for his mother and sister Nakai back in South Sudan and would like to send them a special message. Nakai Chapite Kamina Gita Gita Valak Kamina Gita um Kakunina Kakuna Kachinina Gita Kamina Gita Valak. Jennifer Mirabal and AZ Today. Thank you for that, Peter.